Hi guys, Candy Toy Box here. Today you will need clear and rainbow pony beads. You're also going to need a spacer bead. I'm going to use stars, but you can use hearts or whatever you have on hand. You're also going to need a long piece of string, scissors, a lighter, and a needle. So on one of the ends, we're going to take a clear bead and just tie it once just to hold this end while we're working. On the other end, you're going to put your needle on. We're going to add four pink beads and then one clear. And what you're going to do is take your needle and go through just the pink beads. You're going to grab the clear and this string you're going to pull Okay, that's what it looks like. We're going to add four pink You're going to add a clear you're going to take your needle and go through all four pink beads. You're going to grab the clear and then pull the string. Okay, we're going to do the next color. So you're going to add four orange. Add a clear, take your needle and go through the four orange, hold the clear and pull the string. We're going to repeat that. Okay, we're going to do the next color, yellow. You're going to repeat that. This is what it looks like so far. Now we're going to do the next color, green. We're going to repeat that. Okay, we're going to do the next color, blue. Okay, we're going to repeat that. And the next color will be purple.
and we're going to repeat that. Okay, so this is what it should look like so far. Now, if yours is too loose, you're going to have to go back, which I might do at the end. Um, what you would do is hold this middle, you hold this middle string, and then grab the clear, and then pull. And you, you would do that with all of them. So you'd bring them all down. You just go back and forth. Okay, um, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a few more sets of rainbow, and then I'll measure my wrist to see if it's long enough. Now you guys go ahead and do the same, and then I'll show you the next step. Okay guys, I ended up adding four sets of rainbow and then I went ahead and tightened this up like I showed you before and then I also went through and made these even. So I just wiggled it back and forth so they're even the best that I could. It'll just be easier for the next step if those are straightened out. So now what we're going to do, oh also you can remove that bead we tied on earlier. You don't need that anymore. Unless you're, unless your string's really short, then maybe you want to leave it on. But at this point, our string is coming out of this purple bead right here. We're going to go through these four purple. And then you're going to go through the clear. And now we're ready to add the stars. So you're going to add a star and then go through the clear. And we're going to do that through every clear bead. And like I said, try to make these straight. That way they're not getting twisted up on you. Okay, that's what it looks like. I'm going to go ahead and do that all the way down, and then I'll show you the next step. Okay, guys, I have all my stars attached, and I came out the last clear. We're just going to take the needle off and put it on the other side of the string. And if you, well, my string's already looking a little short, so I'm probably going to have to add some more string. But that's not a big deal. You would just tie some on. Um, just like we did on this side, we went up. We're going to go, we're coming out of this pink bead. We're going to go through all of these four. And then you're going to go through this clear. Same thing we did on the other side. You're going to add a star and go through every clear bead. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and do this side, and then I'll show you the next step. Okay, guys, once you have all your stars on, what we need to do is get to the middle on both sides. So we're coming out of this clear bead. We're going to go down these four purple. You can take the needle off. And same over here. Well, if I can get it on. We're coming out of the clear. We're going to go down these four pink. You're going to pull both of those really tight. And now 
we can tie these together. And now we need to connect these, so we're going to go Oh, if I can get that on there. We're going to go back where we came from. And you're going to go through this clear. We're going to add a star. And I, I'm going to tie after this star, so... And then cut this. Same over here. We're going to go up these pink. And then through this clear. We're going to add a star and then go through this clear, this clear and the star, and then you can tie this. So this is just an afterthought. I think that it might be easier if you tie this part together first and then weave out the sides to do the outside. This is the first time I'm making this, so... If I was to make it again, that's what I would do. I would I would tie the middle first and then take your needle to to come out here and then do the outside. That would be easier. But this turned out just like I thought it would. It's pretty crazy. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I'll see you next time.